partially broken up, gathered by Hunt. He dishes it off down low. Played back in front, they scored. Joey Martin kicks it home in front, and the Thunder tie it up. It's 1-1 with 57 seconds gone in the second period. And what a tic-tac-toe pass there. Corey Trevino recognizing that Joey Martin was in a great spot with no defenseman even near him. He gave it a little tappy. Tap, tap, tap a -roo. And it's all tied up here by Braden Irwin. Final seconds ticking away, a shot, they score! <laughs> Braden Irwin in front of the net, hammers it home, it got through Ostergaard, and not sure if the power play time had expired, it was right at the last second either way, and it is a 2-1 lead for the Thunder with a minute 23 remaining in the second period. Over far side, constant, low shot, they score! Tipped in front, and it's a tied hockey game with eight minutes to play in the third period. Wow, Ryan Constant, what can you say about this guy? He's had an amazing two days. And there were two big bodies at the front of the net. We take a look at the replay, very hard to see. Either way, it is again a tied hockey game, three to three. And it is Burkemper who gets credit with the goal. Move to the far side, now peels back with it. Dishes it off down low, Hunt plays it on for Constant, who's behind the net. Wrap around, thrown in front, they score! Andrew Clark wins it in overtime again! Wow, what a job there, Ryan Constant. He fed that past the back door and just buried Andrew Clark. And Andrew Clark scores his team leading six of the season now and he is just starting to develop a habit of getting big goals. So the Thunder, they give up a third period lead, they tie the game, and then they win it in overtime. It's now four wins in a row for the Thunder, their longest winning streak of the season. Comes down to overtime and talk about, talk us through that last goal. Yeah, um, no, I cycled it down to Hunty. He made a good play to Connie, who's, uh, who wrapped it. And I was just going to the net, hoping, looking for a rebound, and it popped out to me and had an empty net. It seems the offense has been clicking a lot more as of lately. You know, what do you think is going into that? I think uh, you know we're just keeping it simple and you know getting pucks in deep and, and going down and, and working down low and getting the cycle game going. Uh, you know we're using our points, getting the pucks through pucks, tra pucks and traffic to, uh, to the net and. You know, things are, they're going off guys and in and we're getting deflections and I think, uh, you know, every little uh, puck that goes to the net has a chance of going in and I think uh, it's been working out for us. just wanted to uh, talk to you a little bit about uh, your new goaltender's performance for the evening. Um, his first game with the team and his first win. Just talk a little I bit. Thought, I thought pretty steady considering, you know, he hasn't really been playing much and, and coming in he's had a couple practices with the team and, you know, we tested him, we made him, uh, you know, we put him to the test here a couple times on odd man opportunities where he made some real good saves. So he was challenged early on. I thought he responded well. Can you talk about the, the fight, Sean, coming back twice tonight? Well, I think it's just, you know, the guys have learned how to stick with it. And, uh, you know, something bad happens out there. They, they don't uh, sag. They bounce right back with a couple big shifts. And that's really important that we respond right away. Seems like as the game went on, you gained more confident by the third period. It was, you were practically standing on your head at certain points. Shine too. <laughs> um, so you had some big saves late in the third period, um, and then into overtime, you really, really stood tall. Yeah. Um, just talk us through the sort of. Well, overtime. I mean, I haven't played a game in a while. I wasn't playing. I'm playing hockey anymore until I got a call and I decided to come. So I was kind of out of shape, so I just worked hard this week in practice, and I was confident going into the game because I worked hard and felt good in practice, so I think it carried through through the game. How did it feel to finally be out there again? It felt great. I mean, especially to get the win, it was awesome. 